Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alex and, and welcome back everybody. Now we're back here on the Crafting Dead server. Uh, this is going to be the uh, Charland server 1, I believe right now, what I'm on. So I'm giving this a shot due to the fact that basically you guys all know I've been on the Atlanta servers for quite some time and I took a break from it. So the idea was to try out a different server and see how that would go. New builds, new designs, a lot of cool exciting things that I think you guys will actually find interesting as well. So that was my plan guys. I would like to know in the comment sections what you guys think and are you guys happy to have the server series back um so i'm truly thrilled about this i can't wait to get exploring and things like that so if you guys can all hit that like button the goal will be 100 likes because i know you guys all love the crafting dead and this is something we would strive for you know to show me all the support you guys can go for because i love the crafting dead and this is an exciting series and i can't wait to get started guys to explore this world so let's get started guys and again i will be getting some server rank soon um so that's why i'm testing out the different uh servers like the atlanta charlie and, and Covina so you know if you guys want me to try a different one besides Charland then go ahead but I think this is a really unique one um, I like the way it's built it's very different different from Atlanta because we all grown so accustomed to Atlanta for such a while now so I think this will be a great fresh start as well so we're gonna go and check out this area now I don't have any loots no starter gear or anything but by the looks of this place this can be a pretty decent area it looks like a prison to be honest um, but I don't know if it is and what's the deal with this place but I have no gear to battle these walkers right now. So I'm going to go find um, probably some weapons for us if there's anything around here. I'm probably, I don't know if it's the best idea to lock myself inside this place. Because if that's the case, then I have to uh, punch these uh, zombies out of the way. The walkers out of the way. I, mean, I don't think that's the best idea. But what I will try is to see if I can get quickly inside a building and see if there's any loot. Okay, this place looks dead. I don't want to be in this area. It's a little bit too dangerous for me right now. Um, like that's that's what I'm worried about right now. All right So we're gonna get out of here because I don't find too much use out of this place. Oh my goodness Oh my goodness. We're bleeding out. All right. Well, that's no big deal. I'm pretty much used to this uh, Hopefully we find some type of gear around here um, So we can at least survive a day if possible if not then who cares? Well, am I getting hit from someplace or what is this? Oh I'm infected. Whoa, this is a part of the new update. That's pretty awesome So that means I become infected if I don't uh, cure myself or anything like that. So that's pretty interesting as well. That's also exciting. So hopefully we find something. I'm looking around and it looks like we might run into nothing actually. So uh, that's that's a bit of an issue. So we'll go see what we can find if anything around here. And if we die, it's okay because it's the first episode. Um, so this is more of me talking to you guys and getting some, uh, um, I guess, advice from you guys. What do you guys think? Oh, maybe this guy had something. That would be amazing. Please tell me he had something, man. Uh, nope, nothing useful. Definitely had some gear on him, but it's nothing that's going to be useful at all right now. Oh, uh, man, we got to go find something, some type of shelter. Again, I'm kind of new to this world, so I would have to kind of learn my ways around, if that makes sense. Oh, there's a guy over there. Yo, help me out, man. Is he going to kill me? Yeah, he killed me. All right, well, that's not a big deal. Dash R spawn. That's just a learning. Now we're going to take this serious. All right, we're at a gas station. This is a much better spawn. All right, now we're talking. Oh, boy, there's people in there. I'm out, I'm out. All right, so let's go find out uh, if this little little home has some gear for us. Hopefully they didn't see me. That would have been pretty bad if they did. Hop in here and grab some gear. All right, pasta. Oh, wait, this place doesn't even have... What's the point of having a door? Probably was burned down or something. <laughs> I mean, that's pretty pretty pathetic right there. I was just walking in, closing the door, not knowing that half of the house has already collapsed. So, yeah, that was a bad sign. But so far, guys, I'm really liking this uh, server. The builds are really exciting and really different compared to Atlanta. More of a... Uh, rural area kind of with uh, many homes not really apartments and like city life so I think that's exciting to be honest I think that's pretty cool all right so we got to get ourselves some gear here we got a tactical helmet or what is this called a tan tactical helmet all right pretty good but I need a weapon I got to be honest guys we got to get some gear around here a nightstick all right let, let's get that nightstick hopefully that's gonna do something um, some type of damage if anything comes to worse right now but, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go and keep my distance from people because I'm still learning the, uh, Charland servers right now. So, I still gotta get my ways around here. I'm definitely gonna use this golf club for sure right now. I think that's a lot better, <laughs> to be honest. Um, so, yeah. Alright, let's keep going around. I think I wanna go towards the city because I know we're gonna find more loot. What I'm worried about is we could run into people that we don't know yet. And, by the way, if things looking right now, by how things are looking... I don't know if people are so friendly right now. I feel like they're a bit more uh, bandit style. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's a large herd of walkers coming in right there. 
Oh, I was not expecting that. That's that's pretty dangerous. I gotta be honest. There's a lot a lot of herds down here in the uh, towns, and this looks like a pretty big town. There's a cage over there. Man, this is awesome. Just exploring. I mean, I don't even care if I die a few times, but just exploring this map, it's well worth it to be honest. I mean, this is really interesting. Looks like this is some type of cave. Oh man, I don't know what's going on around here, but the walkers are insane. There's a large herd of walkers following me right now. If I could show you guys, look at that right there. That is insane. Okay, that's that's a bit um, too much for a golf club to handle right now. We got to get out of here. Oh my goodness, this is pretty well packed around here. Actually, there's a lot of homes. I am mismistaken here. This is a pretty big city to be honest. So I kind of want to watch my back here, close myself in here, and see if I can find any gear. A backpack, a purple backpack. You know what? I might as well just snap that on. I don't have much looking forward to with the design here, but um, hopefully we can hold off a few days in here. We don't have much food. I think we just, yeah, we just pretty much finished our food. Hydration's decent, not the best, gotta be honest here. Uh, but let's make our way out of here and see if we can find any other proper resources. Is this a boat here? Looks like this is, oh my goodness. Okay, okay, we gotta run. Looks like this is a big, uh, like, shipyard. I'm not really sure. I don't want to get too close because I am not sure who is running those places. Looks like there's a guy over there. Oh, gosh. Oh, my goodness. There's a large herd around here. I think that guy just got attacked by walkers. Unless he knows who I am and hopefully he wants to save me right now. Oh, my goodness. We're so dead right now. Oh, my goodness. We got to get out of this city. This is the probably the worst decision I could have made right now because this place is full of walkers. Okay, let's get in this hospital. This is the best bet we can find right now. It's probably getting inside this hospital and finding ourselves some bandi uh, bandages and seeing if we can get some type of shelter. All right, all right, where is the gear, guys? We need to find the gear right right away. Noodle's not gonna fix this issue. A noodle is not gonna fix any of this. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is probably a pretty bad start right now, actually. Uh, but again, we're still kind of exploring the world. This is, I'm pretty sure this is a, oh my goodness. I'm pretty sure this is a hospital, so there has to be some type of bandage around here. Um, I mean, a bandage, people keep saying I mispronounced that. Yeah, sometimes they do. Oh, there is, sweet. All right, sweet. Hopefully the infection stops though. I'm still infected, so I don't know how this works because this is the update. So I don't know what I have to do to heal myself. Is there a med pack or is there some morphine? I don't know how this works out. Again, if you guys can let me know in the comment sections, because I'm kind of learning the update as we go. I haven't played it in a while now, so this is a bit interesting. I don't know how I'm supposed to uh, get away from the infection. Maybe just not get attacked by, uh, I don't know, 44 Magnum. That's pretty nice, actually. I don't know how it works. So you guys let me know in the comment sections. I would love to know from you guys. Um, but just looking around, I have no idea um, where to go, what's the best place. So again, I would love to get your guys' advice. I don't know if the infection is going to stop. This is pretty interesting, but hopefully we'll find ourselves some type of um, equipment, some type of gear that would help us heal here because, yeah, we're not doing so good. There's a large herd heading that way, so I think this could be my escape. I can get out of here and try to find ourselves some resources because there's really nothing around here. Small black backpack. Um, all right, let's get ourselves out of this city. Even though we're still infected, um, I'm pretty sure this is not the place I want to be right now because there's going to be a large herd of walkers any time now um, just by me making these noises and just walking around. So I'm a bit nervous. Um, so I'm going to make my way across this bridge and get out of here, probably head back and head back to the city when I'm more prepared because right now I'm not doing so well. And this guy right here, let's actually take him out because I don't know if he has any good gear and he did die. So let's take some gear quickly. Hey, dude, you know what? I'm not, I'm not going to hurt you. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Oh, he's punching. Okay, man, I was going to let you go, but... <laughs> Obviously, you weren't gonna let me go. Okay, black spray paint. Not the best. All right, I gotta get out of here because I'm infected. I don't know how much longer I have to live with this infection spreading. So if anything's gonna be good right now, um, hopefully we find something. I don't know how it works, but uh, we'll learn our ways, hopefully. All right, now there's these useless doors. I kind of want to head this way. I don't know what we're gonna find, but... Um, it looks like we can kind of escape from the city life a bit and kind of head this way. It looks pretty interesting. There's a lot of things. Oh, I, I see like there's some lava around here and some little parkour session. But there's also like a campsite down there. I want to go and find out what that is all about. That is interesting very much right now. Uh, very intriguing. But look at all those. Oh my goodness. That is a lot of walkers right there. I don't know if it's me or 
once they fix this update, there's more walkers around here. There's a large increase of walkers living in this area, and that's a bit worrying, to be honest. Uh, tactical, I don't know what that is about. I'll have to read that later. A lot of cool updates. Empty water canteen. Um, not gonna be too well. I don't know if water's gonna help out. Oh, no, man. I, I, I don't want any trouble. Oh, my goodness. Well, at least we're not infected. Let's, let's, let's get down to business. We're not infected right now. All right, so now it's time to get serious. Um, so I'm learning my ways around the server. I know that I can't trust anyone yet until I get a group. And I'm gonna follow my paths and kind of keep away from any walkers like those people. Um, and I, I guess if I get tagged by a walker, I'm infected unless I find some gear. So I'm gonna kind of stick away from these walkers. I'm not gonna really stay too close to them and hopefully we'll find some shelter. Again, this episode is mostly like exploring the map even if we die a bit. Um, and I'm really liking this, um, Charland, uh, one. So come here and play yourselves, guys, because if you guys are on here and you guys are friendly, then you guys can stand my side and maybe we'll make a clan. I think that is not activated yet. Oh, we can create a clan. All right. Well, that, oh gosh, how do I escape it? There we go. That's something I'm looking forward to, and I hope you guys are as well. Make sure you guys hop on and play yourselves with me, and you guys can maybe get some good gear, and you guys can help, um, keep me safe, if anything, and I'll help keep you safe, and we can make an amazing team, guys. Probably could. All right, so I want to go check out this area just because it looks pretty interesting. Oh, there's a syringe. Now, how does that work? We'll have to find out, but I'm not going to go down there because I'm a bit worried for these uh, walkers that are just roaming around. But I don't know if I can get... What is that? Cereal box? Uh, that's not going to be too good, fighting off a zombie like this. An empty syringe. What am I supposed to do with an empty syringe? I guess it's to beat up walkers with an empty syringe. What a start to a first episode on this new server. Alright, that's pretty good. I think beating up a walker with a syringe is pretty, pretty good. Pretty good, actually. Alright, hopefully we can actually take him out before he kills us. Alright, that was actually close. Oh, boy. We need to find ourselves some bandages right now. A band-age. Band-age. keep mispronouncing it for some reason. I don't know why. It's just, like, stuck in my head like that. It's, like, engraved in me. Weird. I gotta fix that, though. Alright, I got... I heard someone. I heard someone. Hey, dude. What's up, man? Do you have any bandages? Bandages? <laughs> I keep messing that up. All right, let's get out of here. We got to go find some more gear. This is really not helping us out, and those guys are going to be there for a while. Unless we find some type of armor, some type of gear. Maybe we can jump out of this house, if anything. What are we doing on blood? Okay, 80%. We can hold through. I think this is not too bad. Not looking too bad here, to be honest. Uh, all right, we're going to have to pull this zombie in and then jump out if we can make it out. Yes, there we go. All right, we got to find a new hospital to get some more resources. We're not doing too good here. So, let's see. Is there anything here? A dirty rag. All right, we'll just probably use that and go to the nearest water areas for now. And probably just uh, fix us up with a clean rag once we get to that station right there. All right, hopefully... Oh, okay, there's a guy over there. He distracted the walker. I should be able to make my way out. Yes! Cool. All right, cool. That was well planned. Not really what I was expecting to happen, but it worked out pretty well. And now that we can get ourselves um, a clean rag, we can actually heal ourselves and hopefully... And it looks like we're not infected, so that is actually interesting. We're not infected even though we did get attacked by a walker. So, uh, if you guys are up to date with the walker situation and the infection stuff, let me know in the comment sections. I'd love to know from you guys because that is something that's intriguing me right now. How was it that I got infected and how is it that I can get myself uninfected if that's, uh, if that's even possible? So let me know. Um, that'd be awesome for me to find out. A wooden stick. That is what I've been waiting for all day right now. Just one wooden stick. Dirty rag. Definitely gonna take that with us right now. We do have some ammo. A rotten apple. Just will take for backup if anything goes to worse right now. So that should be okay. And just looking around. I think this place is like a mini town. I'm not really entirely sure. But I want to head off to this hospital. Because I know that there's going to be more blood bags. More items around here that we can definitely use. A baseball bat. Yes. That's, that's, more, that's more like it. Alright. Now I have a walker walking in here right now. <laughs> so I can easily take him out if he wants to jump on in. But I think he lost track of us. Well, he lost interest. So that's always a good thing, to be honest. All right, let's look around. Is there any way else I can get around here? Okay, there is. All right, good. 
So now, I don't know. Oh, clean rag. All right, now we have plenty of rags so we can get attacked by any any walkers around here. Uh, but yeah, this city is pretty interesting. Got to be honest, has a lot of people around here. So I want to keep my distance, if anything. Um, like, as you can see, there's one guy down there being attacked by a few walkers. Um, but if anything, by next episode, I want to head down towards that hospital or keep going uh, past that water tower and see as far as we can go or we can follow this pathway. You guys let me know in the comment sections and if you got up to this point, write down in the comment sections hashtag Charland and uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think or hashtag the walking dead server returns, whatever you guys are uh, willing to do. So you guys do that. Oh, we got an M9. Now, if we can reload this, that is a well done mission. Oh my goodness, we have already a gun. With 15 bullets ready to go i think we are looking pretty sharp right now guys so if you guys are interested to see more make sure you guys hit that subscribe button make sure you guys stay tuned leave all the comments in the uh, comment section down below and uh yeah guys i'm super excited for this this new world this new server is very well built um definitely more uh intriguing for me because i played on atlanta for such a long time that this is something exciting for me i can't wait to explore more of this place and uh, see what we come across. If you guys enjoyed, my name is Alexon. See you guys later. Peace out. Stay foxy.